Well, hello, 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 everyone out there in Tarot Land. This is your girl Zengaya, the Zen Libran, and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel, Narcissistic Abuse Tarot. What's up, y'all? Y'all good out there? I know y'all are divine feminine, and I know you out there skipping. Yeah, everything has changed. You know, karma is being served. It all depends on which side of the karma you own, the good side or the bad side. But it's being served, you know what I'm saying? So it's a reason for us to smile, you know what I'm saying? Because we're getting our good energy back that we put out, you know what I'm saying? It's manifestation time. It's coming into reality. In this reality, I want to say, because it always was yours, whatever you, you know what I'm saying? It always was yours. You know, you just got to have the <clears throat> permission to be able to bring it into this realm. That's what manifestation manifestations is you getting the permission from the divine to bring these dreams you want into this realm you know what i'm saying and everybody don't have that privilege so be privileged that you do have the privilege to manifest all right all right y'all well you know guys um if you if you follow me you know that i check in with my soul family um i check in with the universe the angels mother earth spirit guys and the ancestors and i let them tell me what they see is going on on the ethers and i also check in with the planet uh, at the beginning of the month to see what planet is really going to be affecting us this month and the planet that i pulled that's going to affect us this month is neptune so this is a watery planet <clears throat> so somebody is in their feelings somebody is in their feelings because they're getting karma Somebody is in their feelings because they're getting karma. They be getting karma for being a devil. Yep. They're getting karma for being a little demon out here. Actually, they've been trying to bully somebody. Trying to bully somebody into having sex with them, basically. Trying to make somebody fearful of them so they could have sex with them. I mean, you want to scare somebody into having sex with you? I mean, what a beast, right? What a beast. And he's in his feelings that he couldn't get this done because he wanted to, he wanted to get this feminine pregnant. <laughs> yeah, he wanted to trap her with a child. Ain't he special, y'all? Let's keep him, y'all. Let's keep him. You know what I'm saying? So Neptune is affecting us this month. You know, you got people in their feelings because they call them getting served to their ass for their devilish deeds. And that's what they ass get. You know what I'm saying? And of course, this is the goddess channel, and I speak from the woman's aspect, and I pull from the feminine energy. And I have my three goddesses out here um, to help me deliver this message to for um, you, collective. Um, and the feminine energy that I pull for this um, reading, the first one that I pull is Pele. Pele is here giving us the energy of determination. See, this masculine, he was all out. He went all out. I mean, book wild. He was determined determined see this feminine she's had some growth this summer in her business and he's det he's been watching her so he's determined to control her and the tactics that he uses to control his women is sex so this person was determined to have sex with her because if he had sex with her it, that's all it needed to do and he could control her and dominate her you know what i'm saying so that's why he's been bullying her to make her have sex with him so he can control her. You know what I'm saying? This is Pele giving us the energy of determination. This person is crazy. You know what I'm saying? This, see, but there's people like that out there, out there. This is narcissistic abuse. This is narcissistic abuse this feminine is going through. And this, y'all, you see, y'all don't know our life, man. We be going through it. You know what I'm saying? The second one that I pull from my power of three is my girl Morgan. Morgan is here giving us the energy of rhythm. You know, Morgan, she, 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 she uh, runs the flow. You know what I'm saying? I mean, she helps you uh, end another cycle and transition to a new cycle. And anybody that gets in your way from transitioning to this new cycle, she will take them to the afterlife if that's what they want. Because she about that life. You know what I'm saying? Um, this person made, because of his decisions that this person made, that this masculine made, this connection, this cycle has been completed because of the decisions that he made. So if he keep on, he gonna lose his life messing with this divine feminine because that's why Morgan is here, to take his ass to the graveyard if that's where he wanna go. You know what I'm saying? Y y where you wanna go? You know what I'm saying? You better go on and leave her alone because Morgan, hey, 
She gonna take you there. I'll take you there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And the third one that I pulled is my girl, Freya. Freya is here giving us the energy of boldness. See, you got a feminine <clears throat> that don't play. You know what I'm saying? And uh, she's a moon goddess. You know what I'm saying? She's in this realm and in the outer realm, too. So she's in here in, in and out of the spiritual realm and the physical. See, that's how you should be. That's how you should live your life. But, you know, um, this feminine, she is a warrior. You know what I'm saying? And you can't see, but her uh, her chariot is being pulled by black cats. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, you know, the black cats, they, you know, they in and out of, you know what I'm saying, of this realm. You know what I'm saying? And she's being bold. You know, she's a warrior. She went to war with his ass, and she's being bold with this person and telling this person, it's over. I don't want your ass. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's disharmony between these two. I mean, it's conflict because this person triggers her. This person triggers her because of what he's done to her. And all he wanted was for her to have some compassion for him and nurture him, but he went about this wrong way of getting it. So she being bold to his ass, to his ass, and she like, hey, dog, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, homie. Let me tell you something, bro. This ain't what you want. You know what I'm saying? So you better go about your business. You know what I'm saying? And that's why he's like, Rrr! so he's just even reared up anymore, even more, because he's not used to getting turned down. But you got turned down by this one. You know what I'm saying? She's out there by herself. She's independent doing her thing. You know what I'm saying? She don't want to be with you masking because your, your, your mask fell off. She knows you, you just the facade. You know what I'm saying? Your mask fell out. She's seen what you are. That's why this is ended. Because of the decisions you made, this has ended. And he is in his feelings. He's in his feelings because of the decisions that he made to bully her. That's why this connection is over. And he want to blame everybody around him. He's depressed, y'all. You know. You know. He want to blame everybody around for his mishaps instead of being held accountable for his own. You know what I'm saying? He pitiful, y'all. This is a water sign. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. You know what I'm saying? I mean, they be clowning. You know what I'm saying? They be clowning, man. All right, let's see what's going on out here in the ethers. Neptune is affecting us. You got a lot of people in their feelings this month, y'all. They crying out here. You know what I'm saying? Cry, cry, cry. You know what I'm saying? They crying. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And this person feels that you should have stood by him. Boy, please, get your ass out of here. Girl, these men, what they read from the same book of bull, girl, book, girl. This is narcissistic abuse, honey. And that's why you got to get like Freya. You got to war with their ass. Don't just sit there in the corner and take it. You know what I'm saying? You stronger than them. You raise the roof. You know what I'm saying? Let that beast come out. Tap into that dark side and serve their ass. Make their ass a straight up plate. You know what I'm saying? Plate! You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. Let's see what's going on out here. But this person is crazy. And he all in his feelings because he want to go be a devil because he decided to do what he did. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm -mm, this person needs therapy. You know what I'm saying? He needs therapy really bad. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, y'all. My stomach just growled. You know, I don't eat till. You know what I'm saying? I want me some salmon. I want some salmon. Mm -hmm. I don't like to eat too much meat, but I eat some salmon or some fish tacos or something like that. I love those. Y'all like fish tacos? They'd be so good, girl. I just don't know. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> But yeah. All right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This person tried to trap you. This person tried to trap you. But he had one damn thing coming, didn't he? You know what I'm saying? You you Freya. You bold. You 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 a warrior goddess. He got you messed up. You know what I'm saying? He got you messed up, girl. This is a fool. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because he wants you to take care of him. He wants you, you to get him some money because you're having this growth this summer. Whatever you're doing in your career is really growing for you this summer. And uh, he wants you to take care of him. Boy, you better get your booger nose ass on out of here. Let's see what we got down here. <laughs> yeah, he wants, to be in a, he wants to be in a relationship with you, but you ain't got no feelings for him. You know what I'm saying? I mean, this person, mm-mm. This person mentally disturbed. He like he he crazy. He mentally disturbed y'all. Um, but he wants you to come back to him. He wants you to come back to him because your your career has taken off. Uh, people are uh, 
contacting you for your services. You could be traveling overseas, uh, going to see people offering your services. Um, you could be seen all over the world. Um, you're doing really, really good for yourself. You know what I'm saying? So that's why he wants you to come back to him. Mm -hmm. That's why he wants you to come back to him. <laughs> and he's in his feelings. He is in his feelings. So he started doing magic on this empress because he's his heart, because he was broken hearted. I mean, that's crazy. He started doing magic on her to hurt her. <laughs> because she went about her business. Ain't that something? This person is mentally stir disturbed and he wants to cause a tower in this feminine's life. I mean, he's so immature. He's behind the scenes doing all type of spell work, um, gang stalking, um, having people trying to jump her, you know, just doing all type of messing with a car, just just doing all mischievous childish stuff. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Somebody that likes to throw the rock and hide their hand. You know what I'm saying? You know, um, but he can't. He can't get you to, he's like he's trying to get you to react. You know what I'm saying? Because you sitting behind the scenes by yourself, not bothering nobody. You in Herman mode. You keeping your legs closed. You're not being bothered with nobody. And he want to have sex with you. And he's mad. He's mad. He's mad that you're sitting by yourself. So that's why he's trying to bring a towel into your, in your, into your life. Because he's mentally disturbed. Let's keep him, y'all. Let's keep him. You know what I'm saying? He wants to hurt this empress, so he's doing magic because he's in his feelings. He's like a little bitty boy. She won't be my girlfriend. Boy, get your ass out of here. You know what I'm saying? He don't know what to do. He mad. He hurt. He don't know what to do. He mad. He hurt. All he know how to do is do spell work. That's all he know how to do to try to trap you. But, you know what I'm saying? The spell work ain't working. You know, I mean, he's just a fool. He mad. He mad and he hurt. He mad and he hurt, y'all. I mean, he all in his feelings. Neptune, man. Neptune is here. He's a devil. You know what I'm saying? He's a devil. Man, please. Please. Mm-hmm. And he's doing spell work to call the tower in your life because he's in his feelings. I mean, he's burdened. He, mean, he wants to put burdens on you. You know what I'm saying? Because you won't have sex with him. Because you won't be in a relationship with him. Girl, he don't know what to do. He won't have sex so bad with you. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's loading him down that he can't get none of that, none of that kitty cat, baby. You know what I'm saying? Girl, he done lost his mind. He done lost a child. He done lost it. He mad as hell because you over there by yourself. He don't want you to be single. He wants you to be with him, and he's just determined to have sex with you. So he's trying to bully you and doing spell work. I mean, I'll just get a piece of ass. I mean, you's a weak punk. You's a rapist. That's what you are. You's a rapist because she's not having sex with you freely. You're trying to rape her, make her do something against her will. You know what I'm saying? Under the rest with this spell work. I mean, go on somewhere, man. Go buy you a, a vagina in the box or something. You know what I'm saying? Go, go stick your penis in a watermelon. You know what I'm saying? They do that. Do that. You know what I'm saying? Get on out of here. You know what I'm saying? Go get you a pocket pussy or something. Get something. You know what I'm saying? Go on. You know what I'm saying? He in his feelings. He mad. He like, oh. Yeah, you'll be all right. Go take a bath. You'll be all right. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you scrub your elbows because you kind of rusty, boy. You know what I'm saying? You rusty, boy. Yeah, this is a priestess here. This is a high priestess. You know what I'm saying? And she's called to step up and lead. She ain't got time to be dealing with this masculine. That's why he in his feelings, y'all. I told y'all that she's uh, having some type of growth. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever she's doing. And he's watching her and he's trying to get in on the, on the glory. Man, get your man, salami head ass out of here, girl. They make me sick, man. You know what I'm saying? When this person comes by and approaches you, tell him no. No, because dealing with this person, you're going to have all the dark days ahead of you, sweetie, because he's a toxic bastard. You know what I'm saying? Trying to trap you. Girl, get on out of here. He's a toxic bastard, you know. And this, you're a priestess, but you know, you know, you know what he's doing. Look at you. And a grandmother, you know what I'm saying? You the one that's supposed to see the light. You laying foundations. This is a divine plan. You supposed to start a movement, some type of feminist movement or something for the ladies. You supposed to gather all the ladies together 
You know what I'm saying? I, all the divine feminines, these are the protected earth angels here. You're supposed to uh, gather all the earth angels together, and y'all supposed to go somewhere and do something. I'm seeing Egypt. Y'all supposed to go down there and read those hieroglyphics, okay? They haven't been deciphered because we haven't went to read them. You know what I'm saying? The women, they're hieroglyphics, her writings, the people of the hierarchy, the women, her writings. So the women, the divine feminines, who are the generation of these uh, these heroes, these sheroes, uh, this is a, a, a message that they ancestors left them. So only the people of this um, lineage are able to go back and read these hieroglyphics and get this message that they left us. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And you the one that's laying the foundation for this movement. Go on, girl. Shit. Come on. I'm going too. I'm a reader too. We're going to see it, honey. And if you doubt that you're going in the right direction, don't doubt. You know what I'm saying? Stop overthinking. Keep facing your true north. This is your true north. You know what I'm saying? If you doubt if you're going the right way, you you are, honey. You going you're already doing it. You know what I'm saying? Keep facing your true north. Keep on going, baby. Let this fool, let him cry, stomp, whatever he want to, um, because uh, he can't do nothing to you, honey. He'll be all right. He'll be all right, but we don't even care. He keep on, Morgan going to handle his ass and put him six feet under, because that's what he want to be. Where I want to be. Look, he's a whore. He's a whoremonger. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, honey. What, ooh, what I tell you, it's a great gathering. You are the ones that are supposed to gather these women. You know what I'm saying? It's all coming together. It's all coming together. You finna meet this soul tribe, honey. This is your soul tribe. And y'all all gonna gather and go and read the hieroglyphics, read the, from the pyramids. And it ain't over there in Africa, that Egypt. That's fake Egypt. That's fake. Egypt is south. Okay? Egypt is America. You know what I'm saying? I'm going. I'm See, I'm one of those. A lot of us seers are one of those. That's why they're attacking us. That's why they are attacking us. Okay? Hmm. We got a seer in the house, y'all. You know what I'm saying? And your vibration is rising. I mean, you're an oracle. Honey, you doing a damn thing. You ain't got, that's why he want to trap you. Let him cry. Cry till his eyes fall out and roll under the door. Don't nobody give a damn. You know what I'm saying? He'll be okay. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't, it ain't your problem. Just tell him, I holler. You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. This is what I have uh, for the month, for the um, planet that's going to affect us this for the month of September. It's going to be Neptune. People in their feelings because they're getting their karma. You know what I'm saying? And we got a high priestess here that's supposed to lay this foundation. And um, it's in the divine plan to start this, uh, to start this, um, movement of women of gathering of these ladies to go back and read these pyramids you know what i'm saying read these hieroglyphics i love it y'all i love it so much and i'm one of them and i'm going you know what i'm saying i'm going back to cali 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 i'm going back to cali hmm. i don't think so whatever we going back hey the pyramids could be in cali that's why i just channeled that y'all but hey i'm telling you i'm telling you california was us man California was us. That's where the Griffins were. That's why the gold was there. That's why the Griffins, they attacked, uh, attracted to gold before the colonizers came over there and took all their gold. You know what I'm saying? We had to, you know what I'm saying? California was an island. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's where uh, Queen Khalifa, you know what I'm saying? And her, and her and her warriors was at, riding those Griffins, you know what I'm saying? Flying through the sky. Y'all think this stuff is make-believe, but it's not. It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? All right, y'all. I love y'all. And if y'all feel anybody could benefit from this video, please share it with me, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Share the consciousness and the awareness. It's time, ladies. It's time. You know what I'm saying? And we got a high priestess here that's doing her thing, doing what she's supposed to do. This is a true north to start this, to lay this foundation, to start this movement of the MERS going back to read the messages that their ancestors left them for the future. Oh, I love this, y'all. I love this. I love y'all. And I'll see you guys on my next reading. Y'all be easy out there, okay? Bye-bye.